what exactly is Ayurveda to for a lay person? You know, what, how would you explain it to a lay person? Yeah, basically, a layman um, understands Ayurveda by be, um, making it labeling it like a herbal. Anything mm-hmm. herbal, whenever we use the herbs, we call it Ayurveda. But it's not uh, the same. Mm-hmm. Herbal and Ayurveda have a very basic difference that Ayurveda has few fundamentals on which it is based. We use herbs based on few fundamentals and that is the specialty of Ayurveda. So Ayurveda basically is a Sanskrit word and it means the science of life. Ayur means the life and the Veda is science or wisdom. So basically we believe that all the knowledge Hindi, uh, knowledge on Hindu philosophy, on Hindu medicine, that is Ayurveda, they came from the Vedas. And that is the origin of uh, Ayurveda as well. So it's a 5,000 year old uh, medical practice, which is being continuous. Many practices came in the world and they did got, uh, they got discontinued, then they came again. But this is the only uh, longest Indian medical practice that has been practiced in the world. And uh, we are very... Uh, we feel very proud that we are Indians and we are having the, this great knowledge, which is relevant to this time as well, because of its strong fundamentals. Right, absolutely. So, what what is the connection with <clears throat> yoga and how is yoga related to Ayurveda? So, can you uh, help establish the connection for us? Yes. So, as I told, uh, Ayurveda, the knowledge came from the Vedas only, mm-hmm. and the knowledge of uh, yoga is also the origin is again in the Vedas only. So they are the uh, sister pathies. They are com- they are complementary to each other. When we talk about the Dhinacharya or the ideal uh, daily routine, we give more stress on the Vyayam or the exercise. Mm-hmm. And there comes the role of yoga. We talk about the mind, body and soul integration. And there comes the role of meditation or yoga or pranayam. So they complement each other. We, we don't... Uh, want to do vigorous exercises we don't want to advise people do uh, gymming and other things but yoga is a ideal uh, exercise that one should adopt to uh, his lifestyle and they complement each other I, I will say on, on in the last word that they complement each other they have the same origin that is why we believe on yoga more than on any other kind of exercise right